money supply this morning. April 21st on zero age here, right there, boom. See this article? Money supply keeps on falling and falling and falling and falling. What will happen? The bank are going to tie it up because they are going to be afraid with the commercial bank. So what's happening is let's say you have a loan. Let's also, so let's say, because you know I'm a big fan of storage units, okay? So let's say I have a storage unit and I did not take an SBA, but I went with a balloon payment. So let's say I bought it a year ago to the last three years. And I bought it ago, a couple of years ago with an interest rate around two to three percent. Okay, so let's say because it was commercial, 375%. Now, let's say it is a five-year balloon, you know? And you bought it, you bought this thing, let's say four years ago. All those rates are going to reset on the commercial side, whether it's storage units, apartment complex, especially apartment complex, there has been a lot of commercial investments. And this is going to reset at seven, eight, nine percent. So the banks are going to be afraid and start tightening. This is why you want to run and get business credit. Why business credit? Even if you don't have a business. So I recap. The things that have been extremely helpful on my in my life. You divide like that by two. Here you have W2 income. W2 income is the plague because it's taxed as ordinary income, which is your highest tax bracket. It's anywhere between 20% and 39% of your money. Now, if I set up a business, and by the way, even if you don't have a business, I will show you tomorrow in the process on the uh, funding uh, ma mastery event, how you can in less than two days, two to three days, have uh, your LLC set up, but it needs to be properly set up. And I'm showing, I will show you without a lawyer, no lawyer, your LLC set up, your EIN number, which is your tax ID number, right? Properly set up. I will talk about the addresses, the pitfalls of the address, the telephone, the website, all the stuff that you have to do. You need to be pretty bold in the eye of the bank in the fastest amount of time. In less than four weeks, I want you to be credible, to be foundable. Then I'll show you tricks to boost your credit score before you go to the banks that can be done and reflect on your next when they pull your next FICO, you know, how to boost your credit. And you got to boost your credit above a 680. You have to line up all the lines in a row, 680, 700, to get access to 0% financing, unlimited 0% financing on the business side, right? And if you want to have cash, you can have business line of credit. But there is ways here, just with the 0% line, uh, credit card, the balance transfer credit card and the APR 0% to liquidate those cards, meaning that you can get those cards if you have $20,000 at 0%, you know, balance transfers, there's ways to liquidate, meaning that you can get the cash. They don't want you to know that, but there's ways I will show you to liquidate your cash. That And the key is to own companies. You have uh, one company here, you get five cards here, one, two, three, four, five, and the reason this is your personal side, this is your personal FICO. The beauty here is your personal FICO is affected by your utilization. 35% of your FICO score is utilization. So what I did not understand before and the big mistakes that I've done is I put everything on my personal name. I had business loan under my personal name. I had uh, a lot of stuff under my personal name and I, I kept on decreasing my FICO. I couldn't understand that. And then I finally understood that you want to keep everything on your business side because here banks and credit card company do not care if you have unlimited credit cards. Unlimited, they don't care. They know you have to run a business, unlimited cards, and business line of credit. They don't care. So long you pay. So long you pay on time, they don't care. 
So your utilization here is not as important as your utilization here. So as you build your business credit, you have you you become more and more fundable and credible to the bank, and you have unlimited access to funding without dinging and affecting your personal credit. And this is key. This is key because most people operate here. They make W-2 income with the highest tax, put all their debt under their personal name, right? And they ding, they affect their FICO and they are always in the right race, getting out of a bad credit to get credit and they are in the right race paying the highest tax of income where here you create companies where you have deductions in companies, you invest in asset, you, have, you are becoming a tax advantage person, plus you have access, unlimited access to investment at 0% financing. 0% financing guys, when you get, and you become an expert at getting those 0% financing um, cards, you have unlimited access to fund, unlimited access to opportunity, you become a cash buyer. And a cash buyer in real estate and any other investment is the strongest buyer you can find. Nobody can compete with you because the other buyers are going to say, oh, okay, I'll make the purchase of this building or this storage facility or this opportunity investment contingent about getting a loan. You don't need a loan, you already have the money. So you can go very, very fast deploy investments. In addition to that, even if you take an SBA loan to buy um, apartment complexes or storage units, which I love storage units, right? Or industrial land where you can park trucks, Amazon trucks or U-Hauls or having your boats. We have a lot of RVs and boats here in Georgia, right? Even if you do that and you take an SBA loan where you put 10% down, you already have your 10% from your business, uh, unlimited business funding that you have already funded. And you can do one to three round of funding per year. So one to three times of rounding per year. So even if you start small with a brand new business, let's say they give you 7,000, 10K, 7,000, three months later, you are going to ask for a business increase a business line increase. So here they'll double that. There'll be 15 here, there'll be 20 here, and it'll be like here 15 again. So now you can, here you got the cut at 7, 10, 7. Here you have 15, 27. Now your utilization and your capacity at 0% went from to 17 plus 7, 24, to 35, to uh, 40, 50,000. And you keep on doing that two or three times a year, it is very, very quick before you get 50K, 100K access in business funding, everybody, even with a brand new business. I prefer you use a business that have two years re really of aging, you know, because a lot, especially for the business line of credit, they look for two years in business that have been uh, uh, around for two years and you can buy from companies, but you have to be very careful that there's no existing lien on the business they sell you. There's companies that sell you aging businesses. So there's a lot of tricks that I've learned for the past 10 years doing it for myself. If you follow the steps, there's a lot of tricks. Same with your travel business point. A lot of people don't understand. If you look at Capital One, uh, American Express or whatever, and you look at your reward points, you get one X point, which is essentially one cents reward. If you know the tricks, there's tricks where you go from partner program to partner program where you can three X to five X those stuff. And all the stuff is power, why? Why? Because the value that I have here for my points, I just triple or quintuple it where I can fly first class, right? Get some crazy hotels, you know, our friends, they always ask us, how do you get those crazy trips in Portugal and stuff? Because we know to multi do the multipliers in travel points. We, that shows you how to maximize. This is a little cumbersome to tell you the truth. My wife does it because I don't have the patience. I don't have the time to, to take my points here, send them to this business partner here, to send them to the next business partner to have the maximum points. But... If you are a little patient or your wife or someone in the 
household at a time and they do that, you literally take $3,000 of value, $3,000 of value in point accumulated, which everybody, every household in America has $3,000 of expense, you know, per month, right? And you can make this 3,000 worth 9,000 to 15,000 dollars in travel and hotel and first class accommodation, airport lounges, multiplication. So those are like, just that itself pays for your class 100 times, but your class is being paid right there. If I showed you how to stack properly without being denied the zero percent financing in a difficult world, and a difficult economy where a lot of assets, especially commercial assets are going to drop a lot and you will be ready to be a cash buyer at the bottom. This is where this is going to be extremely powerful guys. And this is stuff that credit gurus, literally, if you apply for every credit stacking, uh, it charges you $7,800 for his trade secrets and source. And this is the exact same source that you are going to get tomorrow for a fee of $497. There's other people that take 10% of all the funds you leverage. If you take 100K, they'll take 10K out of your phone. Those guys, they do it with you. They use your credit. They show you where to go. And you have a contract with them where they take 10% of your leverage fund. Again, you'll get everything for 497 And I don't know. This is going to probably change, guys probably going to go, go higher. I'm thinking doing a credit community, but I want to make it affordable. But it is a very powerful knowledge. People who get $100,000 in business lines of credit and 0% financing will pay 7,810K all day long. You can tell I'm passionate to share with you the stuff because this will change your life. This is not a buy a trade, day trading SPY option, and I have a 50 50% chance of success. If you follow the step that I'm giving you, one by one, by one, by one tomorrow, and the tricks, 90% chance to 80% chance, now you increase your probability that you will get some 0% financing funding and that you will be able by yourself to go rinse and repeat different round of funding. You know, so even if you are in the academy after I'm, I'm thinking doing a community that is going to be super affordable with a super affordable monthly fee, people will be able to share. Hey, I, I was able to get this play in that bank in that sequence. Hey, I was able to get that play with this sequence in that bank, right? And I will show you a lot of sequences and how you do them. But this thing changes every day, especially with the tightening of money supply that I showed you, the banks, there's a point here where the banks are going, as you can see, 50 year low money supply are going to change the rules and having a community and us updating each other on each round of funding is going to be critical for the community success because surely my Godel should say, here, I got this, 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 and this is the bank, the bank, this was no uh, low, no dark, low dark, steady income. Then I can come here and say, hey, this one was two years tax return. This one, so you know, and you write it down on your spreadsheet. So you follow what bank does what and in which order you have to do it so that you maximize the business inquiry. Okay. I love you all, everybody. I'm on two, three and a half hours tomorrow for sure. An hour Tuesday night for a uh, final uh, uh, closure on this. And then we'll open a community the week after, guys. And it's, like I said, everything is super affordable. Go to other guys and see how much they charge in this industry and this knowledge, and you'll be, holy shit, is giving it for nothing compared to them. Love you all. See you tomorrow morning. Take care.